It's time to talk about a potentially serious condition as displayed by this infant who has ophthalmia neonatorum. Take a look at the right eye there, showing that yellow crust and inability to be opened. Often, discharge coming from the eye is secondary to a lacrimal duct which is narrowed and pressing on the side of the nose like so and rolling back can express some of that discharge. But if you have redness, swelling and discharge and a history of gonorrhea or chlamydia in a mother, she may have transmitted those organisms to her baby. Make no mistake about it, this is a serious infection and requires urgent treatment if that is what the diagnosis is. Prophylaxis against development of ophthalmia neonatorum is possible, although controversial, as the CPS indicated in this statement from 2015. Prophylaxis with erythromycin ointment after birth may help to prevent some cases, but is not 100% effective. If a baby does go on to develop confirmed ophthalmia neonatorum, which can be vision threatening, treatment with ceftriaxone, one dose for the gonorrhea and, four, and two weeks sorry, of uh, erythromycin is treatment for the uh, chlamydia. The best treatment, of course, is prevention, so ensuring that mothers are checked for gonorrhea and chlamydia in pregnancy is of paramount importance.